everyone thinking about green screen does it solve everything and how best can you use it and which software provides the best rendering of your green screen stay tuned because we've got a simple solution that takes minimal software and you can actually use your zoom on this let's have a look the room is like it's something like what we've got here right wow all right and then we need to make sure that that is at above my shoulder level doesn't what are we going to do next well one way is using some software like OBS or some Adobe software or Sony, but there's a better software than that. And as you can see now, like the green room is above me, but we'll fix that. There's a better software than that. And that is the Zoom software. And you're thinking, Zoom? What can Zoom do? Well, actually, you can actually Zoom, put yourself in front of the Zoom, in front of a PowerPoint site. When it records, it doesn't record you in front. So what you got to do is something different. So let's let's just go through and setting up this green room, shall we? Here we have the there's the zoom section there. All right, and so let's start a meeting. So just virtual room is fine. You can see you can see that that's starting up. Wait a minute. Let's start. It's connecting. Sorry. All right, there we are, join. Okay, so we're going to join and start video. Okay, so we're going to share the screen. And when you share the screen, here's the, here's the interesting part. And that's where you go to um, advanced and PowerPoint as virtual background. And why, why is that? Because then you go share and you ask for a PowerPoint. And so maybe we open up this PowerPoint, then suddenly, as you hi, so now we have our green screen. We have our green screen, and look, I can wave all the way around. I've actually got it queued up behind me, so there's no corners or edges on each side of the frame. And notice how, you know, the PowerPoint behind me is wonderful, and that's the difference between green screen. I can come very close or can go right back, so there's a lot of 3D. Whereas if you use the virtual screen on Zoom, you don't get this 3D effect. And I can hold up an object here. And then in Zoom's virtual background without a green screen, you cannot render this object separate from my face. But now we've got 3D, I can bring it forward. And as you can see, we have 3D. And that's what a green screen allows you to do. And that makes your green screen so much more effective in Zoom. Now, here's the problem. When you're in Zoom and you press record, it will record the PowerPoint site. It will not record, record your rendering in front of the green screen on top of your PowerPoint. And that's what you want sometimes if you want that as a recording. And so if I press record here, it's going to just render the PowerPoint slide only. So what do we do? Well, I've got a little trick. You go into Zoom and what do we mean? Sorry, what's the trick? You go into Snagit. Now, Snagit is made by TechSmith, the makers of Camtasia. And Snagit is basically a lighter version of Camtasia. And so then you use Snagit. By the way, you get a free trial for, I think, 14 days or 30 days. So I get all students to do that for their assignment. And they can actually capture video for their presentations, etc. Then you need it for 14 days or 30 days. But normally for, I think, 50 or 60 US dollars, you can actually get a full version of the Snagit. Buy it. It's a great investment. Why? Because you can do the following. You click on video in Snagit, press capture, and then suddenly you want to capture your PowerPoint slide here, plus with you on the front, like so. And now it's initializing. Uh, press continue. And you will see there's, you want to get the right microphone. So I get the Samson Go mic, and there it is. Testing, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, there's fine. And now press record. And suddenly, three, two, one. Hi, this is O'Connor. I used to be a sustainability judge for the Hong Kong Sustainability Awards, the Annual Reporting Awards. And I want to talk about the best practices of those who have won the Sustainability Awards as part of the Hong Kong Annual 
Accounting Reporting Awards. There you have, there's me, there's its recording. I'm recording in Snagit, not recording in Zoom. And so we can render that recording by clicking on, by clicking up here, stop. And then suddenly now we have a recording of me in front of the PowerPoint slide. So simple, you watch. Okay. Sustainability Awards, the Annual Reporting Awards, and I want to talk about the best practices of those who have won the Sustainability Awards as part of the Hong Kong Annual Accounting Reporting Awards. There you go. This is O'Connor, and that's how you set up your green screen with simple software, like use Zoom, because Zoom renders the background of the green screen so much better than ordinary software like OBS or, uh, or Sony or Adobe.